<laughs> she would just leave the giraffe in front of her face sometimes. <laughs> and I hold on to it. See, she'll do that. It's like, why not? The giraffe is there. It's content in front of her face. <laughs> There we go. Where are you sliding? <sighs> hmm? Where are you sliding to? Uh. Penny's outfit for today is this gingham style um, orange t-shirt top. It's actually from um, her ama's friend Bob and Carol, so thank you. And we matched it with a pair of white uh, leggings and some running shoes, obviously, because I want to make her wear them before she outgrows them. So this is her outfit for today. Very summery spring. I love the flowers. I love the little ruffles. She's adorable. And she doesn't have much orange too. And it's really hard to find orange in children's clothes. So I really appreciate this to be orange. That she got it in orange. <laughs> Yay. Very pretty, Penny. And it does come with a matching headband. So I'll put on the headband. I kind of want her to wear a hat today, so we'll see. What I also love about this top is that it has a um, inner onesie sewn on together, so it's good when she lifts her shirt up like that. Are screaming. It's the first day of summer and it feels good. It's not too hot, but it's warm and it's sunny. Oh, it says high of 31. It doesn't feel like 31. Maybe because I'm in my t shirts and shorts, but yeah, I guess it's 31. I don't know. That's what my car says. Laying there. Hi, Evan. Hi. Let's look at your hair. Oh, get a lot. Yeah. Oh, it's so big. Oh, my mom, one day, I'm not going to see you. One day, I'm not going to see you. You don't have to see it. You don't have to see it. You don't have to see it. Look at you. I kind of see Stanley. It's starting to like, yeah. Yeah, oh, definitely. Sometimes I see Gong Gong in there. Great grand. Yeah. Try it out. This is your cousins. This cousin Evan. Oh, let's move your shoe. There you go. <gasps> yeah. Definitely have to ask Daddy for one now.
thing is she's leaning forward though. I think it's okay without it. She's happy in there. No, I've been constantly, she constantly wants to like stand. <laughs> like, who is this crazy woman? This is crazy so we're having dim sum with the cousin, their cousin, so. but with my mom and my sister in law. That's going to be annoying. <laughs> so yummy dim sum. And this came out. What does that look like to you? It looks like greens. Oh, steaming up the sun. Mom's with Penny. I'm enjoying my dim sum. <laughs> Ten. We ordered ten stuff. So Penny's with mom right now and I'm just heading over to Promenade Mall. Um, they have an Old Navy there. My brother spent over um, $80 at Old Navy and they were having a cash back event meaning that the amount you spend you get a coupon for cash back. So he spent over $80 that day and so he got a $30 cash back coupon or super cash or whatever it's called. I am going there today to see what I could get and redeem that coupon. He gave it to me saying that, you know, he doesn't really need any more clothes and figured that I need it more or I go shopping more. So, yeah. It's so cool. There's this guy walking around with um, a bell and I think it's to sharpen knives. So I remember back in the days um, that they have a truck that does it. But he has a, like a little trolley. I don't know if you can see he's there. A little trolley with a bell and just rings it. And you'll cut your cut your knives there. Not cut it, but like sharpen your knives. Sorry, sharpen your knives. I don't know how noisy it's gonna be. I have like the AC going on and the window open. Lately Penny has not been sleeping through the night. At first I thought it was because of the crib or because it's a new place or because it was, you know, she's outgrowing her bassinet and she kept on waking up because her arms are always flinging. But apparently it's a growth spurt thing at month four that their sleeping habit goes back to day one where they wake up in the middle of the night again um, either to change or to feed or for comfort because now yesterday like she woke up at three but she doesn't cry she will scream like she'll be like yeah like scream loudly and and won't like you know full-on cry and then so that was at three i got up and just stood outside of her room just to see you know what's going on and just peep through the curtains and she was okay like it looked like she went back to sleep so I didn't bother and then 3:40, I hear her talking again just talking like screaming talking like yeah 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 
like that like not a big cry just talking scream so so then I figured you know what like I better go and and comfort her or just see her because I don't want her to wake up Steve right so so I went in there and she was wide awake just talking away and I'm like half asleep trying to like you know try to put her back to sleep but no, she didn't go to sleep. Eventually she did, but after that, I think. Yeah, and apparently it's like all four months old go back to that stage. So it's not, it's a, no, four months old go back to that stage. So it's a common thing, apparently, that they do. All four months should be going to that stage. And, I, and then my sister-in-law tells me that they peak at week 17 so Penny just turned week 16 so it will peak to week 17 and then goes down again so I have two weeks of this or even more of her waking up at 3 or 4 in the morning no more waking up at 6 30 sleeping through the night so yeah it's alright I get to spend time with my baby with my baby but I should, I have this bad habit that I take, like, I don't know if it's bad habit or if it's bad to have a bed in her room, but I'll take her out of the crib and I'll just lay in bed because I'm just so tired. So I just lay in bed <laughs> with her in her in her bed and just, like, feed her and, and sleep with her and nap with her. So I don't know if it's a good thing having that bed in her. <laughs> Because I know if there wasn't a bed or if, you know, anything, I would have just fed her and put her back in the crib. That's it. That's what I would have done. Did I, like, miss the mall or something? It feels like this is going on forever. I'm still on the same streets. I didn't miss it. I think I did. Uh, see, as I said before, I'm not really good with directions, and if I am, I miss stuff. I think I missed my turn. I gotta backtrack now. So, every bump we hit with the stroller. The flower will like play a music and it sounds as if we're like the ice cream truck walking down the hall. Don't Just worry. got back, right? We were stuck in traffic for over an hour, weren't we? Little Miss P is in a different outfit right now it's because she had her delight actually at the restaurant and we had to change her because it went all the way to her upper back. Now the thing is, we didn't want to change her at the table because there were other people around, right? And then there was no change table in the washroom. So what would you guys do? Turns out we went to the washroom and had to change her in between the sinks with that little counter space. So it was kind of like ew, dirty, but you know, what can we do? Either she sits in her own poop or you just gotta, you know, wipe, wipe, wipe it down and put a lot of layer in <laughs> or a blanket on and just change it. Like it was, oh, we had no choice. We didn't want to do it in front of people sitting at the table. It's a bit more polite to do it in the washroom. Okay, we found Lily. We found Lily. <laughs> Is Lily being silly?
Yeah. 